my dream bank. <laughs> Obviously, and today is about to be a freaking exciting day. It's an exciting day. It's not gonna be an exciting day, if you know what I mean, but it's gonna be an exciting day because what I'm about to get ready to do, if y'all read my title, get ready, prep, prepare, pack, all of that for my dream back. <laughs> So if y'all read by the title, then y'all already know what this vlog is about to consist of. I'm basically about to be, well, start packing for my dream vacation, start prepping, start getting all my stuff ready. As y'all can see in the back, I have all my cameras, everything that I'ma need, basically, that I'm bringing, like all my electronics, my cords, my chargers, my adapters, everything I need, I kinda already have it laid out, already have it prepped. All I gotta do is just pretty much organize it and put it in my freaking suit. Today is April 1st, so April Fools. Okay. What is the start of my season? Well, my season already started. Like, every season has already started. That started back in March. But it's April 1st, which y'all know my birthday is April 17th. So this is pretty much the start of my season, which is going to be the countdown, baby, all the way up until April 17th, which is my birthday. And not only my birthday, my brand's birthday. Lord Bay, L-O-R-B-A-E. Two year anniversary. Pretty much the only thing I plan on doing today is I have to pick up my press-ons because I'm actually doing press-ons for this trip, y'all. Can y'all believe it? I'm not actually wearing nails. I'm actually just gonna be wearing press-ons, which is crazy because I don't really wear press-ons, y'all, unless I'm doing like a shoot. I don't just wear press-ons, but I said since I wanna, like since I'm going all out, since I'm pretty much changing, like my fits is gonna be different. I want my nail sets to pretty much match the different vibes of the fits. So I'm like, I wanna be able to change my nails. So what's the best way to do that? Get press-ons. So I'm getting press-ons. I'm getting four different sets. My lady in LA is making me a pair and my lady here is making me two pairs and she's also making me a phone, phone cases. So I have to pick that up today because she said they were done. Let me show y'all a little sneak peek of it. What she sent me. OMG, so this is my two phone cases she made me and this is one of the nail sets that she did for your girl. Like, look at that for Japan. Oh. And I don't know if I said it, but I'm pretty sure when I'm mentioning Dream Vacation, I know a million, I know a million and one of y'all, a trillion and one of y'all already know what I'm talking about because I have literally been talking about this freaking vacation in my dream vacation for as long as I can remember. Like if you've been following me and watching me since day one, then you know exactly where my dream vacation is and it's Tokyo, Japan. <laughs> It just lights up my day. Like I have literally been counting down the days for this trip, y'all. And I'm just so freaking excited because if you know, you know, baby. Like Japan has literally been my dream vacation for as long as I can remember. Since I was a little girl, I've been wanting to go to Japan. And I've been talking about my dream vacation being Japan for the longest. Like y'all know, I've literally been talking about this. I've been saying like how I'm going on this trip, like my dream vacation soon, which y'all already knew was Japan. And it's just, it's finally happening, y'all. And I'm just like, oh, I'm just so in awe. I'm just so freaking happy, y'all don't understand. If I can like, honestly, when people ask me all the time, like, what is your dream vacation? If you can go one place in the world. And people always be like, where do you want to go? Like, where could, what could possibly be your dream vacation? You've been all over the world. Like, I've literally been Bora Bora, I've been to Maldives, I've been to Italy, I've been to Greece, I've been to Spain, Puerto Rico. No, yes, Puerto Rico, but it's not a part of the, that's part of the US. I've been to Dominican, I've been to Mexico, I've been to Finland. I can't even, I can't even, like, I just, it can't even come, like, in, in my mind, it just can't even register all the places that I've been in the world. But when people ask me, where do you want to go if you had to pick one place in the world? And my place has always been Tokyo, Japan, since I was a little girl. And it's finally happened, y'all. And I'm so excited. I would be out there for not one, but two freaking weeks, y'all. I'm about to be out there a long time, baby, like, living my best life. And I'm a person who believes in when the timing is right, it'll happen. And I'm like, child, I honestly could have been went to Japan but I just feel like all the times that I wanted to go it just didn't really align and this time like right now it's perfect like it's just a <sighs> Lord Bay's two year anniversary is lunching this month it's lunching while I'll be in Japan so that's gonna be freaking crazy because the time difference from the states in Japan is I think 14 hour difference so I'm gonna be like up at midnight having to post for my lunch <sighs> back in Japan 
while we lunching at 10, 10, 9 and 12 o'clock p.m. and 9 a.m. back in the States. So that's gonna be crazy, but I was like, baby, I'm gonna do it. I'll be up at 2 a.m., 3 a.m. if need be, cause I'm going to Japan and I'm still gonna lunch and work as well. So y'all, yes, this is just so surreal. So like I said today, I have to pick up my press-ons. I need to go to the store because I have to pick up a few things. I was supposed to get waxed tomorrow and I was gonna vlog that for y'all and everything, but I don't know if I can do my full wax like I wanted to do. Like I can't get my Brazilian cause I literally started my period yesterday. I'm like, bro, I literally just made my appointment. And I can't even, you know, get my coochie wax because I just came out of my period yesterday. But I was gonna do full body because like I said, y'all, I don't never wax my legs because they shit hurt. It literally hurts worse than getting your coochie wax. But for special occasions, my wax, I already know, baby. When I say legs, you already know what time it is. <laughs> so I was gonna get full body, my underarms, my legs, and my coochie, but coochie is out because I just came out of my period. So I might still go and just get my legs and my underarms done and then go get the last wax at the end of the week when I'm done. So, fingers crossed it is off beforehand. So I'm about to get ready to start organizing my stuff. Like I said, I've already um, have everything out like since, <clears throat> let's see, January, February, March, March. No, not March. February. Yes, yeah, since the beginning of February is when I started prepping and planning for like all of my fits, buying all of my stuff. So I've literally been having packages come in, rolling in, baby, by the boatload since February. And we are now, it's April 1st. So I already have my stuff. I've been, every, every time something comes in, I've laid it out in my living room with the shoes, with the bag, with the outfit, have it all together so I can make sure I have everything. I have all of my outfits already collaged up. So it's gonna be pretty easy. Like I said, I've already, that's the thing too, I gotta go to Best Buy because the SD card I'm vlogging on is gonna be a part of this whole Tokyo series, but then I have this one, but y'all, it's about to be about five to six vlogs popping out in Tokyo. So I gotta get me maybe two, two, three more SD cards. So I have this one already that's new, the one that I'm using. And then I gotta get me like two or three more. So I have all of my cameras. I have my digital camera. I have my charger for that camera. I have my vintage camera, which was a Christmas gift from my lash tech. So shout out to you, Danny. It's gonna come in handy for sure. Like the whole vibe of this camera in Japan, baby, about to hit. We ain't doing no iPhone pictures. I'm bringing my Fiji camera because I'm gonna take all my pictures on this camera. I'm gonna do I'm gonna do phone pictures as well, but I'm taking all my main pictures on Instagram on this camera or her right here, this big baby right here. I got all of my camera chargers for this camera, my big camera, which I vlog on. So I have one, two, and then I have another one that I'm obviously using. So I have three batteries. I have those charging. I got my gimbal, my little mini gimbal charging. I got my GoPro. I got all of these little attachments. I have all of my adapters for Japan because obviously y'all, they don't have the plugs that we have. So you have to get the adapter. I have my other adapters for my computer when I'm uploading my footage. I have my other GoPro. I got another SD card in there. So I have all of my electronics, all of my cameras. I have my fan, but I don't think it's gonna be hot. But I got my fan just in case. And I got all my other electronics ready to go. Over here, I'm bringing this surge protector or this whatever you call this, y'all. What is this called? Oh, extension, whatever you wanna call it. So I have this, I have two of these actually, because as y'all seen, I have like 15 cameras I'm bringing, so I'm gonna need to charge my cameras, I'm gonna need to charge my laptops, my phone, whenever I'm plugging up stuff for her. Anything that I need, I have a bunch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 plugs. So I'm bringing these two. So I have everything as far as my electronics already ready to go. Now let me show y'all what it looks like for my clothes and stuff. And y'all know I moved, so that whole thing, this is boxes, these are empty boxes by the way. But, oh not this one, this is more electronics. But the other boxes y'all, those back there is empty because my organizer, she's been organizing my closets and stuff. So that's kind of like done. I still have a lot more to unpack, but that'll be for the whole house, the, the house, the home that I own series. So y'all can stay tuned for those vlogs. But let me show y'all all these clothes. I'm about to turn the camera around. This is what my freaking living room is looking like. I got all my clothes kind of already laid out in its own position where it needs to be. 
some stuff that came I haven't opened so I gotta kind of put that with this outfit to make sure I have everything that I need for those fits I got me another new luggage y'all I end up getting a trunk and I want two of these but I don't know if it's gonna come in time so I'm just gonna probably just stick with this one so I'm bringing two check luggages and then I'm bringing my carry-on which is right here then I'm packing up my other luggage which is the same brand as my trunk but this isn't a trunk this is just a regular the trunk as y'all can see it's super 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 wide so i'm packing like all my shoes and stuff in there and then in here i'm gonna kind of put all of my clothes in this little baggies and putting it in here and then obviously y'all know i pack my jewelry purses and my carry-on so let's go into the freaking delta app and let's see how many days until my trip. All right, y'all, so it is approximately three days until checking in. <laughs> y'all, this is about to be so crazy. So can y'all see that? It says three days until checking in, and then it has Japan. So what I think I'm gonna start with is probably doing my Crocs. So I got these white Crocs to pretty much decorate just so I can have like some, you know, cute chill shoes, but I wanted it to be like Japan, Tokyo themed. So I bought these charms to go with it and all I gotta do is just put them on. So I think I'm gonna start with decorating those first. So let's get my little baggie. Well, not my baggie, my box. Cause like I said, I've already ordered everything y'all. And so I got these for my phone and my camera to kind of hold on like a little strap and then these are all the little charms that I got y'all look at them all this stuff is on Amazon I might make like a Tokyo Amazon um, folder on my storefront just in case y'all going to Japan and you want to shop all the things that I pretty much bought what I bought on Amazon because I did get a few things off Amazon so yes y'all but all of these little Charms that I got that was like, you know, the theme of the trip. I got these off Amazon. So this is gonna be easy. All I gotta do is just decorate them. I got all white, regular Crocs. So the question is, where are my white Crocs? Because like I said, y'all, I literally got so much stuff that I'm packing. And I gotta find where the actual Crocs is. All right, y'all, I found them. So these is the white. Crocs that I got, just regular white Crocs, y'all. And then I'ma sauce them up with all the charms that I got. All right, so I'ma, and honestly, probably don't even need the bag because I'm probably just gonna pack these regular in my suitcase with the rest of my shoes so we can pop off the tag. This is what they look like, y'all. Regular, basic, white Crocs. And I think, yes, y'all, I got these off Amazon too. I think they run big. I don't know if that's true or not, but I think Crocs run big. I got a size seven in women and a size five in men, but I should have got a size five in women because these are a little too big, especially if I'm not wearing no socks with these, baby. These are a little, a little loose, and I didn't feel like returning them because I could just wear socks and they'd be fine. But y'all, they big. And we got all the little chalk crumb. <laughs> croc charm. That is like a tongue twister, y'all. My chalk, chalk croc charm. And I got so many. I also got these here, y'all, which these is completely separate because the ones I got, this one, y'all, is like a little Hello Kitty. And then look at this one. So these all came in this little package that I got. So this was a 50 piece. Look at this one, y'all, so cute. But I wanted like something else that is kind of like obviously more Japan themed. So I ended up going on Amazon and getting more. So I got this one. It also came with, I think a sushi one, which, oh, so cute. Look at this. How cute is this, y'all? So this one is like, noodles and this one is like a bento box with the sushi and all of that and then ramen got a ramen one y'all and then this right here so i'm gonna mix these up as well so let's get started so y'all i don't really have no direction i'm just gonna kind of mix it in put whatever
y'all. Y'all, the Crocs are done. I literally just put a whole bunch of random ones on it because I wanted it like cute and junky. And y'all, they so cute. Look at them. Ah. All right, y'all, so I've already got exactly what I'm wearing to the airport. Like, I legit have a freaking airport outfit. So, I'm gonna go ahead and kind of lay that out already. So, that's already ready and prepared because my flight is early in the morning, which means since it's an international flight, you gotta be to the airport two, three hours beforehand because I ain't trying to miss no flight, which I did miss a flight to when I was going to Bali. Yeah, see y'all, when I was going to Bali, missed the flight, was so pissed off because when you miss a flight out of the country, especially to a country that's so far ahead, you pretty much lose a whole day, if not two, of your itinerary. So I'm like, baby, I'm not missing no flight. So I got my whole outfit for the airport. So this is what you're gonna wear. I got me a two-piece, like a, what is this, sweatsuit. So I got this, and then this is like a zip-up. And then I'ma just wear a shirt under it just in case I get hot on the plane. And then I got this little hat. Isn't it so cute? <laughs> yes, y'all, ain't it giving Japan vibes? And if y'all don't follow me on Snapchat, follow me on Snapchat because Snapchat been seeing like a lot of stuff that I've already got for Japan already before this vlog. So follow your girl on Snapchat for little sneak peeks, but they already seen this hat, y'all. But yes, I didn't say what it was for, but this hat, y'all, is for Japan. This is my airport fit. <laughs> About to be killing it, but wait, wait, wait. So, I want to bring this bag because I feel like it gives the vibes, especially with this outfit because it has silver in it and I just think this bag gives the vibes because the bag is all silver. I can wear silver jewelry, my hat, and then all my luggage is silver. So I feel like this bag would be perfect. But I'm really trying to debate about it because y'all know my real big oversized travel Chanel bag that I go take with everywhere I go. It's so big and it fits a whole bunch of stuff. And the thing about this, it's big, but it's not as big as that. So if I wanted to bring more in my carry-on outside of my travel roller luggage, my purse would fit it. This might be a little limited. So do I want to look cute or do I want to be functional? I'm pick cute. So I actually had this hat custom made. And y'all, it is so cute with the bunny ears. And I just thought like the ears give it so much character and it's like, it just gives Tokyo. So I got my two piece outfit, my hat, and then my purse. Honestly, y'all, I haven't decided on what shoes exactly I'm gonna wear. I gotta figure that out. I'm probably gonna just wear some slides, call it a day. I have some like black furry slides that match like black in it. So we'll see, but this is the full airport outfit. So airport outfit. So now we own to luggage bag. So I have a full packing system. So what I'm gonna do is pretty much sort out all of my shoes together, put all my bags together, and then make sure everything that I have for my fits is together, if that makes sense. So like I have this dress and this dress is going with this headband and then I have this purse. Ah, look at this y'all, it's so cute. I have this purse to go with this dress. So I'm gonna put the purse with the purses and then I'm gonna put my dress with the headband so that like all of my looks is staying intact. So what comes with the fit is all together, minus the purses, minus the shoes, that's easy. I just wanna make sure I keep up with like little, you know, dainty things that goes with the outfit. So this shirt goes with this hat and honestly y'all depending on the vibe when i get there i'm gonna just kind of fill it out if i wear the hats that i have with different fits if not i'm probably honestly gonna leave the hat out but the hat goes with the fit so we gonna pack it and then i have this dress oh look at this dress y'all how fine is this dress it's like a tube top kind of like what i'm wearing right now but it's a dress and it's mesh so i obviously gotta pack my pasties and pack all of my thongs so this is the dress y'all and it's so cute this dress goes with these gloves and then these shoes so these shoes y'all is where is these even from i think mark jacobs and then i got these earrings so i gotta pretty much make sure i put all of my jewelry together and all of my shoes together, all my purses together. But what I wanna do first is kinda like organize everything with the exact fit. So like whatever I'm gonna be wearing with the fit, I wanna kinda already have it together so I can know 
that I have it so when I get there, I don't, I don't be looking stupid like I'm mixing a piece for the fit. You see what I'm saying? So, like I said, these are the earrings that go with this dress. These are the shoes that go with this dress. These are the gloves that go with this dress. So I think that's everything for the dress. But let me show y'all my outfits lined up. And it's so, y'all, it it's about to be a vibe. Like, honestly, all the looks I'm coming with in Japan, baby, I don't care how long it takes. I'm getting a picture in every single look. And on top of that, I'm wearing every single look. So that's just that on it. But this, if you can see, I've already had my stuff organized inside of my notes and everything. So you can see Tokyo looks. These are all the looks that I am bringing. So like I said, for this one, I have the top, I have the pants, I have the necklace, I have the bag, I have shoes, I have the sunglasses, and I have the jewelry. So I wanna make sure I have everything that you see together so that I don't forget anything. So that when I see it together, then I can separate the shoes, separate the jewelry, and then pack the shirt and the pants together. And then obviously this fit, I have this fit, but <laughs> baby, this fit. Uh, as y'all can see y'all, all these looks I'm wearing with L-O-R-V-A-E. This is L-O-R-V-A-E from the JT, Lorve X JT collection. And then for this pair, I'm wearing these from the summer collection, summer 2023 of last year. And then I'm wearing these from the L-O-R-V-A-E X JT collection. So these are the looks, y'all. Y'all see where I'm going. Y'all see where it's getting me. So y'all see how the looks look and how I put them together and how they come out obviously when I get over there and I take my pictures and y'all see them on the gram but that's what I'm about to get ready to do first make sure I have everything that I need for all of my outfits and then start folding it up putting in my things so I ended up buying new organizers because for some reason the organizers that I did have already y'all honestly then went missing I don't know they just all over the place I guess that's what happens when you pack and you move so I ended up buying new ones so that I can have all of my stuff in these little organized um bags because it just keeps everything perfect especially when you're traveling y'all so if you know you know y'all remember these that I got where I've been had for a while and I was like these is going to Japan with me so I'm obviously packing these. I was going to wear them with these pants but I'm trying to see because it matches this part right here but when online they were like way more plush pink so it was like the, this pink like the pink of the shirt which is like a Hello Kitty shirt and I was going to wear like a baby tee with like capri like crop leggings with the sandals but the pants it wasn't the color that it looked like online. So it didn't match this. And I wanted it to kind of be all pink, but it still kind of goes because the pants match this part in the pearls. So I don't know y'all. I might end up just going with all white leggings. Let me know what y'all think. And then y'all will see what I decide <laughs> when I'm wearing the fit. I have this little vintage piece and I still have maybe one, two, three, four, five different things that I'm still waiting on for looks that's supposed to be delivered today. But y'all, this little vintage uh, jacket is so cute, which is going with like some oversized baggy shorts. Oh, I cannot wait for this fit, y'all, because this right here is really going to kill it. So this shirt is, well, do you even call this a shirt, baby? This top, this whatever you want to call it, goes with the vintage jacket I just showed y'all. So it's going to go under it. But it it's going to work for me because y'all know I ain't got no titties. And don't let the bra fool you because this is exactly what it is. A bra, the girl titties is still small. But this is what it looked like, y'all. This is it. This is literally it, y'all. So this is going under that jacket but obviously i'm gonna pull it off because i pull things off and then i'm packing this shirt because i told y'all my organizer she came over she organized like my clothes unboxed all my stuff that was in my closet because i was like i need to at least have my clothes and shoes and bags and all of that unpacked before i leave or at least before i pack so that i can you know find things and see things that i haven't seen in a while in case i wanted to bring it because when things is in a box you can't find nothing so she unpacked and found this shirt and i was like baby Give it to me, I'm packing me. So this is the shirt, y'all. And I got this like two, two, three years ago. As y'all can see, it literally still has the freaking tag on it. Haven't even popped the tag, haven't even wore it. So I was like, baby, I'm literally bringing this to Japan and it's going with like this yellow fur. If you follow my spam, if you follow me on Snapchat, then y'all already seen it, but this yellow fur is gonna go over it. Ugh, it's gonna be so cute. It says, stop copying me. You're not even doing it right. But let me show y'all the coat. And baby, this is her. This right here is a coat, baby. Let me tell you. Oh, look at this. 
Oh, y'all, look at it. It is so cute. So I'm literally wearing this shirt under this. And like I said, honestly, I think every freaking outfit that I'm wearing in Japan is literally going with my shades. I don't think I have no other shades but Lore that go with every single fit. But these from the L-O-R-B-A-E JTX JT collection. So I'm wearing these shades with this top under this jacket and then I'm kind of recycling a skirt that goes with another fit but I'm gonna wear it with this fit too. <laughs> you see what I did there? So I ain't packing too much even though I'm packing a whole bunch of shit. But y'all see the shades, y'all. And it matches perfectly with the yellow lens and the yellow fur. And then this shirt, baby, it's gonna be giving. <sighs> I get my hair done April 5th and my mom's 50th birthday party is actually that day. So I'm getting my hair done that morning. And then my mom's birthday party, 50th birthday party is that night. So I'll be good for that. But the hair is gonna really, it's gonna break all these looks together. So since I already know these pair of shades is going with two different outfits, I'm gonna go ahead and put these to the side. So I'm gonna kind of line up all my shades right here so that I can have them all together. But I need to first make sure the shades that's going with the outfit, I have them. Also bringing this top because baby, this is just obviously, <laughs> it's gonna give in Japan. Also, like I mentioned, I said I have a few packages, a few items that still is in transit that's gonna be delivered this week. I know a few things has already been delivered, so I gotta go pick those up. And also I have three other packages that's gonna be delivered later in the week, so I gotta get those. But I also have one, two, three, four, five items I think that I took to my tailor to get tailored. So I'm gonna try to call today and see if that's gonna be ready today. If not today, probably tomorrow, I don't know. So I'm gonna have to go pick those up. But y'all see <laughs> all the stuff that I got and I still got most of them. These are three pair of shades that I'm bringing. So I need to put these with the shades because I wanna make sure I have, I already know which pair is for which outfit. I just need to make sure I have them all together and lined up. All right, y'all. So every time I see something new, I kind of just jump to it, but I gotta go back and finish putting all my sunglasses together and organizing all my shoes and stuff. But I seen, I forgot I had these like I showed y'all. My little thing is for my phone, but also for my camera. So I'm gonna end up changing this one that's on my camera now to this one. Ooh, it's gonna really match the vibes. I'm trying to really see. Yeah, I think I like this one more. Cause all the other cute ones I got gonna go on my phones. Which one y'all? This one or this one? Any, mini, my mo, catch a piggy, buy a toe, catch a hoe, buy a toe. If I had to let her go, beat that hoe. Eh, <laughs> I'ma do this one. <laughs> all right y'all, so actually I went back to look at these because like I said, I got so many for my phone, but I only bring in three phones. So obviously all of these ain't gonna fit on the phone, but this one in particular, I'ma put on the phone. Cause this one is just, it gives phone and it also matches the phone case that I got. But I just realized in here, this was a faux pack. So I can probably use one of these. Yes, this is a faux pack, y'all. Ooh. And this is gonna also match like my headphone case that I got. Y'all will see that also. Y'all might see that in another vlog, but it matches the case for my headphones that I got. So I don't know, y'all, which one? I was thinking this one because it's all cute and colorful. Obviously, I took the little black one off. I think I wanna go with one of these on the, on the camera. See how that one looks. See how that, oh, this one looks the best. We gonna go with this one though. Only because I got four, so it don't matter. All right, y'all, so I ended up putting it on my camera and then this is how it's gonna look on my phone. Obviously I'm gonna have, oh, obviously I'm gonna have a different phone case, but this is the one that I decided to put on my camera so that I can do this take my pictures and it's so cute y'all so i showed y'all this fit so these are the shades that's gonna go with this fit oh i'm so obsessed y'all this fit really about to give and then this is the necklace look how fine this necklace is look at the motherfucking details baby and y'all already seen the bag with the jersey these pants these shoes and then this phone case, y'all. Look how cute this phone case was. I was like, baby, I have to get it for freaking Japan. And I don't know if y'all can tell, but it actually, y'all see, it actually moves in this actual freaking game. And I was like, baby, this is so freaking tea. Like, I ain't seen nobody just have a case like this, baby. For Japan, nah. So since I have these shades, I have the whole fit together, I can put the shades with the shades.
these is all the shades that I'm bringing. I don't think I'm missing none. I'm gonna look around and make sure. I'm gonna look back at my notes and look at my fits to make sure I'm not missing a pair for the fits. But I think these is it. Okay, y'all, so I forgot to add in my Polaroid cameras. So I also got a pack, two more packs of these, a pack of two, and then I got these for my Polaroid. And then I have an extra pack that I just randomly found. And then I ended up adding my portable chargers for my phones. And yes, y'all, I think that is, that is it now for my electronics. So I got all my electronics like y'all seen. I got all my shades together. Now I'm about to gather all my bags so I can put those all together. And then all my shoes. And then start folding up things to put in the organizers. All right, y'all. So looking back at my fits, I forgot. I got to get these. I got it, I got those, got those, got those already. I gotta get these spotlights. So I think it's three more pairs I gotta get because I just found these which is coming too. So add them to me. All right y'all, so now I'm about to get ready to gather up all my purses. I kinda already did my checklist, made sure I had them all. So I'm about to gather all them up, put them in like a, its own little pile so I can make sure I have every single purse that I need. So. Let's get the purses. All right, y'all, so I got all the purses minus the little bag over here. Oh, no, I don't. I got one right here. All right, y'all, so this is the majority of the purses. So I'm gonna put all these together on the chair so I can have these ordered. So as you can see, I got most of my bags that was already down here already in this chair, but I got majority of everything. Y'all, look at this bag. Look at this. Look at this baby. Oh, you guys about to kill this style profile. But like I said, this is the majority of the bag. So these all together, shades is all together. Oh, we looking good. So I'm in my closet because I need to make sure I bring down all the shoes that I'm bringing. So these I'm bringing. I was trying to debate if I'm gonna bring my Dark Martins. I have two pairs of Dark Martins. I have this one with like the little big lace and it's kind of shiny and then I have these which I don't even think I wore these, y'all. These is dusty. <laughs> so I feel like if I was gonna bring a pair, it would be this pair. But I don't know if I got a fit for these. So I'm like, do I need, really need to bring them? Because I don't have like a fit. I was just gonna bring them just to bring them in case it just went with something. So I think majority of everything that I'm bringing in this closet in particular, I already have. So it's just these shoes. I'm looking around, y'all, making sure there's nothing else in this closet that I'm supposed to pack and bring. I think it's just these shoes. So I'm looking at this purse and I'm actually mad that I don't have no fit and I didn't, you know, create a fit to go with these because we'll go with this bag in particular because baby, this bag is cute and it gives Japan life, don't it? It gives Japan, but I'm going back again. So I guess I'll pack it for that. So I need this bag. And honestly, at this point, like I said, I kind of already had my stuff already pre you know, organized pre-out. I'm just going around looking for things that I can pack that can pretty much, you know, serve for another outfit, like this bag and the another one that I need. But this is it, this one and two others, I'm good on my purses and then I already have them already in this designated area, so we good on that. All right, y'all, so I forgot that I had this sweatsuit also. This is one that I'm gonna bring with me, but I think I'm gonna probably just bring this just to casually wear if I wear it, if not, this would be my travel outfit back. Or this might be my travel outfit on the train or to another part of Japan. But it's a cute little sweat suit. And look, y'all. It has bunny ears. Look at it. <laughs> How cute is that, y'all? And then these are the sweats that it come with. So it has little bunny ears on it. And so, y'all, the whole theme that I'm going for in Japan, y'all will see it's gonna be like incorporated in probably every single outfit that I have, but it's bows. Bows and ears, bunny ears. Like, y'all, I literally have bows, bow leggings, bows in general. A big freaking bow that's literally the same height as me. That's at my alteration lady. That's what her, she's doing that for me. But I have that, an oversized bow, bow shoes, bow dresses, bows. Like, that's literally the thing, y'all, bows. Like I said, it's probably gonna be incorporated in every freaking fit and obviously to bunny ears but i had to show y'all this because look at this this is so cute <laughs> the ears 
Okay, y'all, I don't know how I missed this bag, but when I was looking through all my shoes, because I'm about to get ready to put all my shoes together, I found this bag, y'all, and this literally goes with the outfit, but I found it, so here it is, and it's going with the bags. But look at it, y'all already know what it's say, baby! Represent, big Aries. Comment down below, y'all, all the Aries, tap in. It's about to be a lit season. All right, y'all, so I'm about to get ready to line up all my shoes. We're gonna start with these. Reeboks, which a lot of my shoes, well, I'm lying. These, these ones right here in particular is a pair of shoes that's going with two outfits. So I tried to do recycle shoes, recycle bags, even though it don't look like it, but I did. <laughs> so that I don't have to pack too many, even though I'm still packing a lot, y'all, it really, it really don't matter. But I'm starting with these, so I'm about to get ready to line up all my shoes. I got them already in the pound. So let's line them up. Yo, I bought these shoes to go with an outfit, but I don't even know if I got the outfit, but I think I'm still gonna just pack them. They golden goose shoes, but I thought they were so cute because they made like this, but they look vintage-y. But I just like the red star. That's kind of like what I like the most about them, so I think I'm gonna pack them. I have all of my shoes together. I'm only missing two pairs, but other than that, this is all of them. Alrighty y'all, so I'm about to take a break from packing. As y'all already seen, I kind of got everything in its own, you know, pile, sorted out in its own sections. But I'm about to take a break because I'm about to get ready to go pick up my press-ons and my phone cases. So I'm so excited to see them. So I'm gonna do that. And then I also think while I'm already out, I might as well stop by the stove because I gotta get a few things from the stove. Like little mini things from my toiletry bag and I also gotta pick up a few little makeup items. But yes, let's go do that. Alrighty y'all, so I ended up picking up my phone cases and my nails. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, yes. Perfect. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye. Bye. I actually randomly called just to make sure or just to see if she was done early with my stuff at the Taylor's and y'all she was so I was like y'all let me go ahead and slide by and get this so I first went to go pick up my phone cases and my press-ons and then I went to go pick up my stuff from the Taylor now as you can see your girl is literally charging her car because I've been all around the world I, 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 and I randomly made an appointment to get my eyebrows threaded and tinted but y'all I was like okay so I usually get derma planning but I'm like last time I went she said she can wax she waxed faces but I'm like I don't know about waxing but I usually get my upper lip threaded but I hate it so I was like special occasion so I might as well get that done so I'm like I might as well get my full face waxed so not waxed threaded because my skin too sensitive to get my freaking face waxed it's 5 12 I got an appointment at 6 30 to get my full face threaded and then get my eyebrows threaded as well but now I'm charging my car first and I'm about to go get some food because I'm hungry I literally haven't eaten none all day so I'm gonna do that <clears throat> And then after go back and kind of hit back up on my packing. All right, y'all, getting poppies with well, Olipop first from Whole Foods. Okay, y'all, I'm waiting on my food to come out, but I'm looking at this video. Oh, and you about to break the neck once again, might I say? <laughs> Alrighty, y'all. Food is served. I got bison pizza, y'all, with caramelized onions and extra cheese with shredded cheese on the side and red pepper. Mm, I'm so hungry. Y'all don't understand how hungry I am. Mm, have a little bite. Mm. Also, y'all, I got ranch to go with my pizza, as you can see. This look green because I think it's called like Hatch something ranch. I think it got peppers in it. Mmm, mmm. This ranch is so good with this pizza. Mmm, mmm, mmm. -mm. Alrighty, y'all. So I've made it to my thread appointment. <laughs> y'all, I'm literally threading this. Not thread. <laughs> I'm literally dreading this, y'all, because I've never had my face threaded. Like, I've had my upper lip threaded, and I did that joint one time. Never again, because that joint hurt so bad. So I can only imagine what a full face would feel like. So I'm a little scared, y'all. Eyebrows, I'm used to it, even though that shit still hurt occasionally. But y'all, face? Oh, MG. I'm literally so scared, y'all. I'm literally dreading this. <laughs> But let me give y'all a little before. Y'all see the brows. The brows always come out good. My girl literally get me together. So this is the brows. This is the face. 
So this is like what the side of my face look like. I have a little hair right here. And then she also gonna do my upper lip, which uh, I don't even get any start on it. But like I said, y'all, this is, only time I do this is special occasions. So this is a special occasion, so I'm gonna suck it up and do it. But I just know that she about to hurt. Let's go. <laughs> look at my freaking face y'all it is so freaking red but you can kind of see the after it's gonna be so smooth but this is how my eyebrows came out like y'all already know baby the eyebrows always looks good and let me tell you the face actually didn't hurt the lip though the freaking upper lip this right here I can't I don't see, I try, and even special occasions these days, baby, I've done. I've tried, I've tried, and I've tried, but this shit just hurts too bad. It's the next day, y'all, and I have a few errands I gotta run. I gotta go get my wax. I have to go to Ulta, go to Sephora, I pick up a few things there. Also on my to-do list, I'm going to get my nose ring changed because I got this particular nose ring that I wanna put in just for Japan, so I wanna get that changed today. Oh, I gotta run in my office because I gotta pick up a few packages there. Whew, and like I said, sit on my phone. So let me show y'all the new phone I got. All right, y'all, so like a few weeks ago, I ended up going and buying a new phone because one, I needed a new phone, like a new main phone because child, I done had my phone for a while. I think my phone I have now is a, I believe it's a 13. And my work phone that I have is a 12, I think a 13 as well, but it's a newer version. So I've had this, my new phone for, a little bit, but this phone I've had for years, y'all. Literally since the 12 came out. And so, she old, the camera don't even look the same no more. So, I wanted to get a new phone, y'all. Just for Japan. I've already took it out the box, because I was gone. I tried to charge it up to turn it on. But this is the new phone, y'all. I wanted to get a 14, but they didn't carry the 14 in the stores no more. So, I'm like, well, y'all did that on purpose, because y'all want people to get that new phone, which is the 15. So, I was just like, forget it. I ended up getting the 15, which is perfectly fine, because I heard the camera is good and that's honestly why I wanted a new phone for the camera in particular because this camera is still good but you know after a while when you had an iPhone for too long maybe because you've been looking at it for a while but the, the pictures and the quality don't hit the same when you get a fresh fresh new phone if you know what I mean so this is your girl new phone <laughs> I'm so excited so I ended up getting black because it was between black and white and so everybody on my Snapchat was like, go with the black. And I was like, I'm gonna go with black anyways because all my phones is black besides my work phone. My work phone is actually army green, which I wanted to be different with my work phone. So I ended up getting it in army green, which I love, by the way. But the new, the difference between these, can you see y'all? Can y'all see that? That's the difference. This is the new one, this is the old one. The camera quality, all of it is better. I gotta put this on the charger. And the only thing about this is the charger, y'all. The charger is completely different. So I had to buy a new charger, as you can see. And then I had to buy, well this came with the phone, but I ended up getting another one because I wanted a extra long cord. So I had to buy another one. And then I think, if I'm not mistaken, the adapter, or I think they said the old adapter works, but the cord is different, yes. So my old adapter should work, but the cord is different. So I'm gonna put this on a charger because I'm gonna set this up because I want to set it up ahead of time. And so my plan is to only transfer messages, notes, my calendar, and contacts to this phone. I don't want no pictures on this phone. I honestly don't want messages, but I have important messages that I don't feel like having to go back and look on this phone. So that's why I'm gonna put my messages. But I don't want no pictures, baby. I want to start fresh. Oh yeah, I'm so excited to have a new phone. Y'all don't understand, I literally been Contemplating, and I was just like, I'm gonna go to Japan, so I might as well just go and get me a new phone because I hate changing phones. I don't like switching phones, especially when a new one come out. I don't like getting it right away. I like waiting, but I don't like getting new phones because I hate transferring my footage and my photos and all of that over, but I think it'll be so much easier since I'm not gonna do my photos. Like, I'm just gonna do nothing. Strictly calendar, pictures, contacts, notes, and messages. That's literally it, no pictures. So, like y'all seen, I went and picked up my two phone cases that I'm bringing to Japan. 
Ain't they so cute? This one is like all things Japan. So you got sushi. Everything Japan, y'all, is on this one. If you can see right here, it's a Tokyo. And then this one is kind of like a kawaii phone case. And I got it to go to fit my new phone. So, and it do, baby. It's so cute. And then, like I showed y'all yesterday, I'ma add my little charm I got for the phone. But y'all, look at this. This is so cute. And my phone just turned on. So, I guess it was charged. Oh. So happy to have a new phone. Y'all, I'm so freaking excited. I also forgot to mention y'all, I want to transfer my apps over to. So other than that, that's it. No pictures, no nothing else. Alrighty y'all, so I just made it to my wax appointment. It is 10.59, my appointment is at 11 o'clock. And like I said, I'm only getting my underarms and my legs waxed, which is why I got on the skirt. And then this little top to take off, so it's easy to just remove it. And I ain't gotta take off all my clothes. But like y'all know, I'm not getting my Brazilian because yeah, it just can't happen today anymore because I came on my period. So I'm trying to reschedule that for Friday. But I still didn't want to cancel my appointment. I still just wanted to come anyway so that I can go ahead and just get my legs waxed because that hurt the worst to me. So like I said, my appointment at 11 o'clock, so I'm about to go in, so let's go. so bad. Man, it hurts so bad. All right, y'all, so I ended up going to Tropical Cafe. I got me an avocado smoothie, y'all. This is literally the best one that they have. This is literally the only one that I've ever had there. 10 out of 10, and it do got avocado in it, but don't knock it till you try, baby. So good. Alrighty y'all, so my wax is done. I'm about to get ready to run some more errands before I get back to the house and finish packing. But I need to go to Ulta, go to Sephora, and I need to go to Target, but I think honestly, I'm gonna go to Target a little later. I don't feel like doing it right now. So I think I'm gonna just go to Ulta and Sephora first and then head back home and finish packing up because honestly, Target can wait. And I can go there at the end of the week or I can go there tonight, it don't matter, but I just need to go ahead and knock out Sephora or for show. So, that is what's next. All right, y'all, just left out of, where did I just leave? Sephora, so these are the only thing, well, it's three things that I needed. The one thing that I did need, which was a foundation stick, they said this location doesn't sell it anymore, so I'm gonna have to try to order it online and get it delivered, but I got these two eyeliner pencils because I needed this, so now what I need next is only at Ulta, so that's the next stop. Made it to Ulta. All right, y'all, so I made it back home. Like I said, I had to run my errands, go to Sephora, do all that, because I had to pick up a few makeup items, because if y'all watched me on Snapchat, then y'all would've seen that I had like a one-on-one -on -one makeup appointment with my favorite makeup artist. So she kind of taught your girl how to do my face, kind of how she does it. Literally gave me all the techniques, and then she made me a full list of everything that she uses so that I can get. And so we ended up going makeup shopping. The things that they didn't have available, she ended up giving me a list so that I can get it on my own time. So that's that's what I had to pick up. I insert the little footage I got when I was there doing my one-on-one -on -one so y'all could see. All right, y'all, so I am at, well, today I am doing my little makeup class with friends. Hey, hey girl. Who's <laughs> best to give me my makeup appointment or makeup tutorial or help me do my makeup the way she does it than her because she really does my makeup best. So that's what your girl doing. She's doing like this half and then I'm kind of like working my way and doing this half. Is there a difference or does it look the same? I think it's looking the same, so. Alrighty, y'all. So, my one-on-one -on -one makeup class went good. She said your girl did good. Like, look at my makeup. Like, cutie baby. I will be accepting appointments now. Books will be open. <laughs> Call me professional makeup ding. But the face is already beat and I'm about to get ready to put my clothes on and get ready for date night because tonight is supposed to be an exciting night, y'all. I'm super, 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 super excited. So I kind of have an idea of what I plan on wearing. The only thing I gotta do with my face is touching my lips because I ate. So I need to touch my lips. 
And then I kind of, like I said, I already have an idea of what I'm gonna wear, so I'm gonna put that on because I gotta be heading out soon. And so the one-on-one -on -one session literally made perfect sense because I had it, I scheduled it for before I go to, you know, obviously before I go to Japan. So obviously your girl can do her own little beats all professional and stuff while I'm out there. So I'm so excited to, you know, put it to the test. I haven't really just tried it again since my lesson, but I got it because she also gave me step-by-step -step in my notes as well. So all I gotta do is just follow that and then I have all the products. So it's gonna be easy. Also, I forgot to mention or show, well, y'all seen it, but I forgot to mention or point out, like look at my face now. Now that's not super, super, super red right after, but y'all, it looks so good. When I tell y'all my skin, it's so freaking smooth, baby, like butter. Makeup is gonna literally glide on. I cannot wait because look at this. It literally looks so good. <laughs> ah! So y'all know since I moved, all of my stuff is literally everywhere. So I'm trying to find, cause remember I said I had all of my shades, minus like a few, maybe like two, three, three left that I need to find. So I'm looking for a purple pair that I'm trying to find, y'all. So I've literally been looking all over my house, literally since yesterday to try to find these. So I'm gonna look in one more other place because I asked my organizer and she said, check this area. So let's see. And I'm looking in the bag, y'all. And look what I see. Can y'all see it? Literally right here. From the Crystal Clear collection, by the way. <laughs> Copper pair 234. Uh, so finally, these were the last two pairs that was needed to complete my full sunglass collection for Japan. <laughs> All right, y'all, so I ended up changing so that I can be more comfortable because I'm about to pick back up on my packing. I also gotta show y'all what I picked up yesterday from my tailor so y'all can see what she did. And I gotta try it on because I haven't tried it on yet. But y'all, I literally just got a freaking email from my travel agent. She sent the full itinerary of every single thing, y'all. And I'm so excited because this is so surreal. Like, <laughs> yeah, it's about to be crazy. I'm not, honestly, I'm not gonna even tell y'all everything. Well, I'm not gonna tell y'all anything that I'm doing there because y'all will just see and be surprised. Y'all already know like one thing I'm doing because I mentioned earlier or before that I had to get my international driver's license. So if you know, you know. But stay tuned y'all for the full itinerary and everything that I'm doing in Japan because it's about to be lit. Like looking at it, I am so excited to literally just look at every single day that's on here. Like it's gonna be a vibe. And she also put a checklist. So this is what you need for your checklist. Passport with at least six months of validated check because like I mentioned, I'm on a journey y'all to get my passport fully stamped until it expires. So I'm good on it. Obviously I already got my ID, my IDP, which is my international driver's permit. Clothing appropriate for the season and activities check. Comfortable walking shoes check even though I got a lot of heels but I do got my comfortable shoes for walking personal hygiene items check sunscreen and sunglasses I don't got sunscreen but I think I already have it anyway so I don't have to go buy no more sunglasses but like, y'all already seen your girl literally comes with the sunglasses I literally am a CEO of a sunglass brand so why wouldn't I have it? Also, portable chargers, y'all seen that? Check, power bank, check, personal medications, check. So I always bring Tylenol ibuprofen with me every time I travel out the country, so I already got that. And I also have cash. What I'm gonna do, what I plan to do, is just, just get it exchanged when I get to the airport. So all of that is check, y'all. I usually don't travel with a lot of cash, but Japan is literally gonna be like, it's gonna be a show. Like, just stay tuned for all the Japan vlogs. But I just had to mention it, y'all, because I am so, so excited. And y'all know when I travel out the country, I literally do not, like, I know a lot of people travel out the country just for pictures, no shade. <laughs> No shade, don't see no shade. But I know a lot of people travel out the country just to get pictures and just to, you know, post on Instagram and just to say they was in another country. But y'all know when I travel and when I go out the country, baby, one of my itineraries be extensive in detail because I actually like to indulge in the culture of the country that I'm visiting. And this, like y'all already know, like this is my dream vacation. So I have to literally do everything there. And like I said, it's not gonna be my first, my second, my first time. Well, this is my first time visiting, but this won't be my last time visiting because I do plan on going back to Japan again. But yes, y'all, like I said, I love to experience the culture, the food, try new things. Y'all know, literally, I would eat anything, baby. If I've never had it, I literally would try it at least once. So it's gonna be crazy. Like, I'm literally trying all the crazy stuff. My mom was like, you gonna eat anything and everything in there? Baby, whatever y'all, whatever I see, I'ma try it for sure. So just stay tuned for it. But I just wanted to 
point that out because y'all already know, like, when it comes to me and when I travel out the country, baby, I don't just, obviously, I'm going to travel and I'm going to look my best and I'm going to take pictures and I'm going to post and I'm going to vlog for y'all. But that's not why I travel. I literally travel for the experience and I literally love doing activities and I love indulging in the culture of all the countries that I've ever visited. So this one is just going to be, this is just going to be <laughs> memorable. I literally found exactly what I was looking for and I completely forgot that I put this up here because I moved it when the people came to finish my closet. But my sunglass case, because I gotta put all my sunglasses in here. Obviously the ones that's gonna fit, the ones that don't fit, I'm probably just gonna end up packing in my purse that I'm gonna carry onto the plane. But for the most part, all of my shades is going in my L-O-R-V-A-E sunglass case. As y'all can see, this one is the biggest one. So it holds, the slot literally has, we have a four pack that literally fits four and this one is like the big, big, big. So this is the one that I put all my shades in. Cause when I travel, baby, I carry a lot of shades. And then this one is a 12 slot. So I use my four slot for my jewelry anyways. So I'm gonna just put all my shades that I'm carrying that can fit in here in here but also too i don't know if y'all noticed but this comes off of the organizer and you literally can just have it like this so this is what i'm gonna do when i get to my hotel in japan so that i can see all my shades and keep it open for my fits but yeah and also too this is a different color because this one right here is was a sample the one the original one or the real one that y'all if y'all order and y'all get it's a complete different color so that is why this is black because i ended up wanting them to change this color to match the color of the actual box but yes y'all i'm about to put all my sunglasses in my case sunglasses is done i only have these left but obviously these are super oversized so it can't fit in there but like i said i'm gonna carry these in my purse all right y'all so this is all the stuff that i got from my um tailor that i picked up y'all remember what i told you about my literally life-size bow that's gonna go on my head yeah this is that stay tuned for that look but like i said i just ended up having her tape in, take in some jeans three pairs and then she ended up adding my bows to, not my bows, my clamps to my bow so that it can clip on my head because it wasn't an actual bow that goes on your head. I turned it into a bow that go on your head. So these per, I wanted them to stay real big. That's why they look big, but I ended up putting them on so that it can fit how I wanted them to fit, but I want, still want the baggy. So she said she ended up taping it or taking it in on the side instead of the back. Let's try on actually. Yeah, this how I wanted them to fit. This is exactly how I wanted them. Ah! And y'all, literally when I put these pants on, they literally was sagging to literally right here. So she did them perfect so they don't, they're not falling, but they still baggy how I want them. They look so good. Next was these per. I wanted them more fitted around my waist. And when I got the pants, the button, like this part right here, was sealed for whatever reason, so it was impossible for the button to be closed. So I asked her to open it up. But I wanted these more fit around the waist. Oh child, that about to be hard to put up now. Yes, this is what I wanted, y'all. Look at this, look. Look at how tape. These literally went all the way to like right here. Look at how they go in now. Literally perfect. But these are super long and baggy. She asked if I wanted her to take them up too, but I didn't want her to. I wanted them to stay long and big at the end. I just wanted it to cinch in the waist area. And so this is the other pair. It fit exactly how I wanted it to fit around the waist. Perfect. All right, y'all, so I got all my packages from Amazon. Woo that I need to open. I got these little plastic container things just to store a few little mini pieces. I probably can put rings in here, honestly, like if all of my rings don't fit inside my little organizer case, I can probably put that in here because I didn't even read when I was buying these because I thought I was buying two, but it's a six pack, but I can put them in these. I got more 
of those. This look like this was returned. <laughs> Y'all see that? It looked like it was returned and then they packaged it back up, like tied it back up. But these are like the vacuum storage bags because I want to vacuum all my big coats. This, these is my face tissues. I literally got a bunch of packs of that because I'm going to bring one of them, but I also need some because I ran out here. And then I got my organizer things that I was telling y'all about and that y'all already seen because I already had these, but I needed more. So this was like, I think an eight. A piece, so we got like a medium, an extra large, a large. It got a bag, it got one for shoes, but obviously my shoes ain't gonna fit on them. They got this little toiletry bag. So this is perfect. I ended up getting not one, but two. And so I also got me a phone stand, but I got one with a light on it because I wanna be able to have good lighting. And I hope, honestly y'all, it didn't look that big online, but y'all, I hope this joint is not too big. Cause I really don't feel like traveling with nothing huge. Honestly, it's not bad. This is the light. And then it comes with a little piece that your phone come in. And then obviously the stand. So I'm gonna actually, what I'm gonna do is pack this inside the box like this. So my light don't break and then this right here. So that is everything I think I got from Amazon. I'm gonna open this actually because I want to see what these look like inside. It was open and we taped up. Oh, these is, oh yeah, oh yeah, baby. Oh baby, these is gonna work for me. Oh, this one might be too big. It come with all these bags, but they got different sizes and it come with a little pump. The pump that I had before, that one is electric. But like I said, my stuff is packed up, y'all. I don't know where that is. And last time I used it, it wasn't really effective. It took too long. So this might be easy for me to just do myself. So we gonna figure it out. All right, y'all, so I have three Big coats, well this one is not really big, but it's still a coat. So I think I'm gonna pack this coat, the yellow one y'all seen, and then I have this big one, which is already in a pack. So I honestly could just leave this in here if I wanted to. Yeah, I probably might just leave that in there, so I ain't doing too much. But for the other two, I'm gonna pack up and put in here in the bag. This, I didn't want to just do them two pieces. I have this dress, I'ma just fold up and put in here also. Y'all, I actually like these, or like this set better than the other one. I feel like it gets way more compressed. You gotta do a whole lot of this, Whew, but that's a little workout and I'm fine with that, but I feel like, look at this. Look at this, y'all. This gets compressed way more. y'all so I packed well folded up all my denim and then I just decided that I'm gonna put them in here to compress down for most for most things y'all as you can see this luggage is packed up I still have to put this stuff in the luggage but I gotta get the luggage <laughs> But this whole luggage is done. I've already started packing up my carry-on, so like my electronics, purses, and cameras. And then I'm about to pack up my underwear bag, so I literally got all new thongs <laughs> so and underwear. So I gotta pack up more boxes of more underwear, and then my bras and stuff is gonna go in here. I'm about to get ready to go get my nose ring changed, so when I come back, I'm gonna kinda sort out all my jewelry and accessories. This luggage, is officially done, locked up and closed. I got my camcorder charging up, my extra batteries, cause it's coming on with me. And then I got my phone, my phone cases, my press-ons, it's all coming on with me on a plane. So that's gonna go in here. Child, like I got beat up. But the only thing left now, y'all, like I said, when I come back, I'ma sort through my jewelry, get that organized, finish packing up my carry-on, pack the rest of my stuff in my other luggage 
and I think I am going to be done, y'all. I think I'm going to be done. Because I already had like my purse, the purse that I'm carrying on is already there. I already got laid my whole outfit out, my airport outfit. It's already good to go, so I think that's it. The only thing I have to do now is finish running my errands. Like I got to get more SD cards and Best Buy. I got to go to Target, and I think that's about it. So, but so far, y'all, we done. I literally forgot to open this, y'all. So I'm going to open this and put it on my... We'll put it in my carry-on. So I got this scarf, but I'm gonna wear it as a head scarf instead of a regular scarf. Like a little bandana, that's how I'm gonna wear it. Y'all see the fit when y'all see the fit. But I'm gonna fold this on up, baby, and she gonna go right in the carry-on lunch. All right, y'all, so I am dressed. And ready to go. Like I said, I'm about to get ready to go get my nose ring changed. It's in my purse. I don't feel like digging through it, but it's in my bag. So all they gotta do is change it. I know the last time I got my nose pierced, they had to kind of re-pierce it because the piercing that I had before was smaller than this one. So I'm going back smaller, so it shouldn't, it shouldn't, it shouldn't hurt. And they shouldn't have to, you know, use a needle, but Look at this curb, y'all. Look how close it is to my car. And wonder why my rims look the way they look. They gotta do somebody's curb, y'all. This is what I came to the office for, my packages. Alrighty, y'all, so I've made it into Target. I already got a few things. Next, I need mouthwash. So I'm gonna get this one, because this is what I do. And I already have a small one, so all I'm gonna do is just refill it. Never mind, y'all, I found the travel one, so I'm gonna just do travel. All right, get the SD cards, it's two y'all. The ones I used, it was only two. <laughs> so I'ma just get these two and that should be good. Alrighty y'all, so I went to the piercing shop and they said that the piercer wasn't there today. So I ended up calling another one. I really liked that one because when I went in the last time, she, her vibes was good, but she not there today. And I did call and they said she don't come in until Tuesday. So I don't understand why I still went, but I assumed that another piercer was there, but I assumed they just got one. So she ain't there y'all. So I ended up calling another one. They said they can do it. So that's where I'ma go because I gotta get this done this nose ring changed today. So I'm about to eat and then go get that done. Alrighty y'all, so I ended up getting Dan Dan noodles, which is basically noodles and spicy sauce with ground pork and then scallions. Mm. You gotta mix it up so you can really, you see that? Y'all, these are so good. All right y'all, I got cumin crispy lamb. This is literally like, oh, ten out of 10 baby. I literally always get this and then a side of fried rice because it come with it. Woo! All right, y'all, so I've made it back home. As y'all can see, the nose ring is changed and I love it. But now that I look at the nose ring with a smaller gauge compared to the one I just took out, I actually like it bigger, the bigger gauge on my nose. So when I get back from Japan, I'm gonna end up changing it to the one that they had because they literally had the perfect one, literally the one that I got when I first was pierced, but it's a bigger gauge and it's gold, it's like pure gold. So I'm gonna change it when I get back from Japan and I'm never, ever, 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 ever change it again because I actually went back smaller right here. But he said I should be good, y'all, when I come back to change it I shouldn't have to get re-pierced or anything like that so fingers crossed that this is not the hole doesn't close up and form around this smaller version because if it do I'm gonna have to get pierced again if y'all seen on snapchat baby it wasn't a, it wasn't a pretty sight I literally almost passed out because it hurts so bad and I just don't I don't do well with pain tolerance anymore a pain tolerance went out the freaking window so right now I am just organizing all of my jewelry putting out all my jewelry so that I can pack all of this up. So I'm about to get ready to pack up my jewelry. Got my rings, my earrings, making sure I don't forget. No pieces that go with outfits. Look at these little cute ones with bows. Oh, so excited. As y'all can see, my jewelry still wrapped from when I packed up and moved, but I'm about to get ready to finish up packing my jewelry. So y'all, I come upstairs in my room and I literally just see something at the corner of my eye and it's $2 bill. I think my organizer sitting right here because she probably came across it when she was going through my clothes and sorting through stuff. <laughs> but I just thought this was so funny, y'all. <laughs> but I'm gonna take it. But I hope you all enjoyed this vlogging vlog and uh, 
I'm just, comment below if y'all are excited for all these vlogs that is about to go down in Japan. Like, it is literally about to be a lit. Like I said, probably five to six vlogs will be popping out, baby. And the trip is literally gonna be magnificent, baby. Like, when I tell you the itinerary, hundred out of 10, baby. So stay tuned for all the Japan vlogs. And this is like my prep. Y'all getting ready with your girl to go on my dream bake. So, I love y'all so much, and I will see you in the next vloggy vlog. See you in the next vloggy vlog. See y'all in Japan. Love you. Bye.